Bryn's an interesting night in terms of team performance and personal performance. Let's stick with the team to start off with. What did you make of the game? Yeah, there was there were lots of positives to take out of it. We've been working hard in terms of our build-up play and, and on and off the ball, a lot of tactical work um, and obviously a lot of running at the moment. So um, it's good to kind of put that into the game and obviously it takes time to, to mould and, and let it sink in. So I think there's been good positives from today. You started out at wing-back, which was a bit of a blast from the past. Did you enjoy it? I did, yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's it's uh, it's a lot on the lungs compared to the, the, the right centre-back role. Although, I guess right centre-back, I, I would drive and, and run with the ball quite a lot. So, similar in some ways, just different areas of the pitch. Uh, but no, I enjoyed it and I, I like to play any any position that allows me to run forwards. I enjoy it a lot, so no problems. Yeah, you switched back into that right centre-half role, didn't you, towards the end. Yeah. Do you see a confirmed role for you in this Luke Williams team yet or do you think there's still a lot of stuff to be ironed out between now and the start of the season um, I think it takes time and you know there's a lot of competition so you know we've got a lot of good players in this squad um, the depth is fantastic um, so we'll just have to wait and see I think collectively we have to all work hard as individuals um, focus as a team to help um, help almost integrate what the manager wants us to do um, and then we'll, we'll go from there so everyone's working hard as they can and then you know hopefully we'll be prepared and ready for the start of the season you're one of our longer serving players I think fans would be interested to hear what you've made of, of Luke and Ryan's approach so far fantastic um, obviously it's always nice to work with different types of people different types of per personalities and and philosophies I would say it's not too different to uh, the previous Ian Birchnell um, but obviously new managers and, and new slightly new tweaks here and there obviously takes time as players to build those habits you could say um, but no they're, they're fantastic and obviously very positive in, in the way that they want us to play um, the expectations and the standards are very high gold standards that we have here um, so you know it'd be exciting to, to get the campaign started two friendlies left we finish at York but it's Forest uh, next week that should be a really good occasion and a really good challenge isn't it definitely obviously they they'll be on a high with the momentum getting promoted to the premier league um, it'll be a fantastic test for us obviously we don't get me wrong we want to we want to win every single game but these pre-season games are very much based on the the fitness and also the the style of play that we're wanting to integrate at this moment of time and and let it sink as as a team um, that's what we're heavily focused on at the moment trying to put the training and the hard work that we've done into these games and use it as an opportunity before the before the new campaign and that new campaign is looming large now isn't it it is i'm excited as always it's, it's nice and I look forward to kind of getting the pre-season done as quickly as possible. No, no player really enjoys running around, especially without the ball. So, um, yeah, I'm really excited. And obviously, as a team, we just have to make sure that we're prepared to go again and, and uh, get the positive outcome.